Boston-based company As You Wish has a stall at Boston's Sowa Winter Festival for the first time this holiday season. The company's founder, Amanda Santello, launched the business on Instagram and Etsy in 2016. My like target audience, I have noticed here, are 30-somethings all the way to like 70-year-old. Santello is successful in the physical card space, but data suggests that online greeting cards are gaining in popularity. Kingpin Market research data shows the online greeting card market will increase in value by nearly $700 million in the next five years. One shopper says he grew up with the holiday card tradition. I feel like, you know, when we were a kid, uh, holiday cards, you always had like the family photo with like the sweaters and everything, all the family like lined up. Uh, and now I feel like it's no card, just give the gift, yeah. Maybe like the little like uh, the tag that goes on it, but no card, yeah. Santello says part of her success comes from her Instagram presence. And data suggests she's not alone. A 2017 report from the National Endowment for the Arts shows nearly half of all visual artists who share their work do so online, compared to about 15% of recording artists and 40% of creative writers. With BUTV 10, I'm Annie Quinn.